In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to make the circular spring. First, I'm going to start with a sketch in the front plane. So I'll select front plane, tell them I want to make a sketch, and I'm going to make a three-point arc. I'll set my center point here, come over and put this point on the origin, and sweep to 180 degrees. Next, I'll use mouse gestures to dimension this. Make the radius three inches, push escape, and I want these three points be horizontal. Now my sketch is fully defined. I'll right click and I'll exit the sketch. I'm going to look at the part isometrically. Zoom out a bit. So the next step, I want to sketch in the right plane. So I'm going to select the right plane until I want to create a sketch. I use mouse gestures to activate line. And I'm just going to create a horizontal line. Using mouse gestures, I'll activate dimension. And this line is a quarter inch long. Fit the geometry back to the screen, push escape, right click to exit this sketch. And now using these two sketches, I'm going to create a swept surface. So the first thing I need to do is come up to my toolbars and right click, select tabs, and I need to turn on the surface toolbar. So I'm going to find the surface toolbar and click to turn it on. So I'm going to select surfaces. And this time I'm going to make a swept surface. So as the profile, I'm going to choose this line, and as the path, I'm going to choose this line. Next, I'm going to come down to the options and expand it. And here, I'm going to tell it to follow the path, but I'm going to add a twist. So the profile twist, I'm going to tell it to specify the twist value. And I'm going to say how many revolutions I'd like it to twist for. And then I'm going to enter 30 revolutions of twist. The preview looks good, so I'll accept that. Next, I'm going to sketch a circle in the right plane. So I'm going to go back to the right plane. That's all I want to sketch a circle. I'll look normal too. I'll use my mouse gesture to activate circle. And I'm going to put the circle on the edge of my surface. Drag out and click to create it. Use mouse gestures to activate smart dimension. And I'll set the diameter of the circle to 0.125. I'll right click and exit my sketch. And I'm just going to rotate around. So next, I want to go back to the Features ribbon and tell it I want to create a swept boss. With the circle selected, it sees that as the profile, and as the path, I'm going to choose the outside edge of my surface. And I'll right-click to accept that. I'm going to come over here to the Surface Bias Expanded, and I'm going to hide my swept surface, and I've now created this circular 